LinkedIn value tumbles, stun social media. LinkedIn shares plummet on week first quarter earnings report, as with all short and long-term investment goals, dynamic price expectations cause different reactions from Wall Street. SunTrust lowered its price target to $250 with a buy rating, and Breen lowered its price target to $172 with a sell rating. Both firms cited the same information regarding LinkedIn's outlook after the website issued a week second quarter report late Thursday. For the second quarter of 2015, LinkedIn is expecting earnings at 28 cents per share. Their targeted revenue during the same period is expected to be between $670 million and $675 million. Analysts were expecting earnings of $0.74 cents per share on revenue of $717.5 million. The company offers individuals and corporations a platform to manage professional identity. In addition, people can build and engage with other professionals in their networks. While stock analysts view LinkedIn as a commodity, LinkedIn users see it differently. I invest a more valuable asset than money into LinkedIn, commented Doug Crow, founder of Authority Fusion, a branding and public relations company. Our clients invest a consistent amount of a much more valuable asset, their time, stated Crow. Mainstream users once viewed LinkedIn as a high-profile resume bulletin board. However, for many key executives, marketers and public relations agencies, LinkedIn has become a virtual, professional, networking meeting. With groups targeting specific industries and demographics, many users see it as a way to connect with ideal clients. The vast majority of users still see it as a digital resume, but when you tell a compelling story in your profile, use the proper keywords, and professionally connect with your target audience, the right connections can come swiftly, said Pro. I encourage my clients to not only look for their target customers, but look at their own network as a resource for others. It's easier to approach someone with a gift of a referral, than ask for one when starting a relationship. While paying it forward makes sense and most business owners agree in principle, it is a practice that is rarely done. How many emails have you received, out of the blue, with someone offering a referral to you? Question Crow. While LinkedIn struggles to increase its value on Wall Street, savvy users like Doug Pro continue to pay it forward, building strong connections off of LinkedIn as rapidly as possible. I have confidence in the platform. However, the main idea is to take online conversations into offline relationships. That where you see the power and speed of LinkedIn. How LinkedIn harnesses that speed in the coming months may determine if it is a valuable hub or just a professional version of Facebook.